So there's Rob. Don't be like Rob. And make his mate come out on a blizzard like Sunday to hotwire a wing. Well, well, blizzard in South Africa is 20 degrees. Anyway, first thing is to get the spar straight, because in the wisp of the spar is straight, so there's a gut line over there. And Rob's going to mark a straight line on all the foam blocks. There they all are. And then we're going to hotwire them. So this is the right wing. That's joint R1. Template number one is going to go there. Template two is at that one, and so on. Template three, template four, five, six, seven, and template eight at the end here. So now Rob's laying out the left wing, and he's remembered that he's not going to build two right wings. So he's marked out to right, and now he's marking out a left. So holding thumbs. So there's the marks for the front edge of the spar, left wing, on each block using the gut line, making a mark. Joint one, left wing, so L1. Joint two, L2, L2, L3, L3, L4, L4, etc. Okay, so there's template one in position, and the all-important spar mark, the front of the spar, which is straight, and it's sitting on its lower half of the template. And we're about to screw it on. There's number two. So the first block has obviously got number two on the one side, number one on the other side. It's ready to hot wire. Now we're going to put some more templates on the other blocks. We trimmed the blocks off front and back. Using the hot wire, just to tidy them up a bit. There's our hot wire. And it's running off an arc welder, and we've added a bit of resistance to tune the temperature. And if you get the temperature just right, you'll find minimum wire lag. You can see a little bit of a curve, a little bit of bow to the wire, but not too bad at all. Okay, we're ready to do our first cut. Yeah, there's our first cut. Rob, kind of happy. He's a, that, that, that's, that's his happy face. It doesn't get better than that. And it all looks looks good. Nice straight lines. And we'll get someone to hold the camera in a moment as we do the next cut. Okay, so we've resorted to using sharpened spikes rather than screws. The screws are a bit of a pain. And we're on to template four here with three on the other side, and obviously still the left wing. So here we've got all the templates on to just clean up the edge here. We're gonna cut off this piece here, and in we go. Quarter. Half. Three quarter. 20 mil to go, and going out, and same on the back, going in, quarter, half, three quarter, 20 mil to go, and going out, okay, top outer off now, and ready to cut the top surface, okay, we're going to do the top skin, the top surface rather. On and along the leading, halfway along the leading corner, 
rising up, half, one, and a half, two, three, half, four, four. Circle one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, up, up, corner. on the top of eighteen, eighteen, of nineteen. Twenty. Thirty one. Oh. Two. Two. Tenth of break on. The reason for that is to cut off this little piece over here. Let's flip it over. We're going to lose this little bit here. Entering quarter half three quarter and going out if it's turned over now now we're going to take off this outer Cut the lower surface. Okay, let's go. Is your circle between twenty one and twenty two? Yeah, it's about ten more off. 
Okay, good. Right, scanning on. On the lead in. Halfway. Touch and up. 0.5, 1. And a half. 2. 3. 4. 5. 6. 7. 8. 9. 10. On the corner and down we go. 11. Now down and into the circle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, corner and up, top corner and along the top. Twenty-two. And there the numbers go for slope. Coming up to 23. 24. 25. 25. 26. 26. Okay, so turn it back on. Over here. There we go. Quarter of three quarter. And out we go. 